It's an ill chill to look at the past in the future tense. It was there. I could see. All things were past in the past. The present never needed. The future tense. I must always come last. And so last I did. In relationships, time and again. 
What do you count for? I count for nothing. And 21-year-old me knew this already. To be, to whisper, in the bedroom, all so careful and so muffled, so that my grandparents couldn't hear. I didn't want them to see. It was unfashionable then. No, more than that. It was abhorrent then. Limp-wristed little puff, that's what you are. That's all you are. Oh, what a gay day, Larry. I saw you. I saw you. I saw you looking at my arse. You were, weren't you, you little puff? Puff. Puff. Twenty-one-year-old me. That's all I would be. Wouldn't say boo to a goose. Couldn't. Unable to. Like at four. At four, I couldn't say a word. My grandparents had sent me for tests. Was he deaf? When I did speak, finally, it all came out in sentences. There was no dada or mama, probably because there was no dada or mama. Nothing was certain, nothing. I was nothing. Christmas lights, they almost fall down. Santa Claus at the end of his plot, all year round with his gnome and supply of pots, he smiles at everyone. I knew of a boy and he dreamt of the stars. He tried to write a play, but he never could start. He was selfish, though. I knew of a girl and she was raped. Took him to court, he got out on bail. It made the papers. And down on the street, in the back of a police car, my friend and I hold a pounding heart. Looking for a gang that have snatched her back. It's half an hour since, as we drag on our last fact. A race is on, three cars in the high street. Five big kids have lost us in the back street We give up the chase as it's hard to identify Thugs these days have sprouted wings to fly The college looks proud as it smiles at the crowd The students are strong, the demonstration is loud Stop the loans now it's not all bad, but it's certainly not good And the car fumes smell as sweet as they should It's my home for now So we cram into the bar and fight to get past It's the last day of term and the drink doesn't last Alcohol the saviour breaks the idea Of a Christmas in Stoke with family cheer And I laugh along Try to pick up like there's no tomorrow Just how we should Though we try to get the money for a taxi fare But no one ever really pays their share The road outside races with cars As the Capri holds a chase with a clapped out lot of the man in the Indian winds is a grin One more joke about dogs And he'll be backing in the lights are on And no one's at home As the rugger bugger threatens me On my own but with a drink inside I'll open my mouth I want to argue, but a belch comes out Well, we can't be glamorous all the time said I should have HIV positive stamped across my forehead. I'm not even sure if I'd had sex by this time. She said this in the sixth form. She also said that God intended for man and woman to be together. That's why Noah's Ark had happened, and that's why the animals were led in two by two so they could procreate. Mrs told two of my friends that they should not hang around with me. She was the dinner lady. She said they'd catch AIDS from me. I told my form teacher, glass-eyed Mr. 
but he was friends with Mrs. So he told me it was nonsense. I went to the deputy head teacher, Mrs. She talked French. Mrs. had to retire early at the end of the school term when her son, Thug, found about this. He grabbed me by the throat and held me up against a wall at break time, threatening me as his mum had lost her job. I hated chemistry lessons. Mr. T clearly gay and the bullying was so much worse one time mr T left the room for a very long time on this occasion my very worst bully him and his mate they came over to me and in soft, mocking voices asked how Larry, Larry Grayson, was. They came up close to me. They started touching me. They put their arms around me in front of everyone in the class. Everyone else in the class was laughing. They thought it was hysterical. They started tracing their hands down my chest, over my arse, in the inside of my legs. I became aroused. They told everyone. I found out years later that at the same time, was regularly being noshed off by my so-called best friend, I developed a thing about threesomes in later life. Say, Levy.